So just like the autoclave here I mentioned pre previously, we have another uh, machine that we use to sterilize called the statum. Now this is something we use typically, it can be used for anything, but this is a fast sterilizing uh, machine and we typically just reserve it for a select things like your XCPs, anything plastic or rubber like um, parts of your motor, the um, uh, slow speed polishing motor. Um, we have a whole list up here of different things that should go into the statum and not into autoclaves. So uh, rubber gloves, Cavitron hand pieces, nitrous oxide masks, um, piezos, hand pieces, and XCPs. So this is our large statum, and this is our small statum. You can fit a whole lot more into this one, but we do use this one as well for XCPs and other small things. Um, when, just like with the autoclave, you need to check the water levels first. Now in order to do that, we have to pull this out carefully and there is a little cover with a filter and inside you can kind of look and see how much water there is. Now you want it to fill it so that the water is touching the very bottom of this filter. So I have my distilled water here, it must be distilled water, and I'm going to pour in enough water to fill this up. Okay. So I see it touching the base of the filter and you can always double check as well just by pulling it out again and then replace the cover. If this is off in the morning also the switch is in the back on the side so um, we just have to turn it on. Sometimes they get turned off. Now this is a touch screen so we would um, be able to, when we want to start things, you can see here now that the screen has changed and it has the same settings. It has rubber and plastic pouches unwrapped and then the start button. And I'll go over that again in a minute. So this is the cassette. And prior to loading anything in, you want to check the water levels of the buckets underneath the statum. So when this steams, the water drips and collects into buckets underneath here. And so underneath each statum in the cupboard, there's a water bucket. And you want the water levels, you can see it's about halfway full or so. The water levels need to be between this black line and this black line. You cannot empty all of this water it needs to at least have some above this black line and it can't be higher than this black line. So if it's filling up quickly um, and it's you know almost to the top, you need to open this up, it just is a screw top and dumps them out in the sink. But this one's between the black lines so we're good. Now this cassette is a little tricky um, because it has a handle. When we place things into the cassette, the handle needs to be on top. It can't be underneath like this. It won't load properly. You won't be able to fit it. Now don't, over, don't ever force these into their little home here um, because you'll break it. So we'll just lean this back and we kind of tuck our fingers under this handle and push with our thumbs, and it's like a vacuum seal. This is the lid, and inside here we have some sterilized instruments. I'm going to take that out, and place them on the clean side. And you would want to take some paper towel and just wipe any wet or residue in here, or puddles, or any type of drops or anything like that just to make sure it's nice and clean. Um, and then you're going to line your instruments in here again in a nice straight line. And I'll just get some instruments from here. So you'll have your integrator strip just like we do for the autoclave. 
and it would be placed right in here, name and initials, and then we are going to place things nicely into the statum, and that looks about good, just like this. There's a little lip that this notch fits into in the back, so you're going to slide that into the, the lip and close and squeeze until you hear it kind of blow air and then bring the handle forward and then we are going to load it in here and you will hear a click when it is fully engaged into the statum. Just like that. Now you can press the screen to bring it back up to the menu and we have pouches in here again so I would hit pouches you'll hear it beep and then you'll press the start button and it'll start um, heat sterilizing and saying it's heating up and everything. Now you want to watch here because if there's not enough water or for some reason the pH of the water is off it'll have a warning label, uh, a warning screen here and you'll want to um, make sure that you correct any errors that pop up on these. Same thing with this one you would load in some instruments, integrator strip in the middle, everything like that, and then it has a little lip as well. So you want to put it in the little spot and then squeeze it together and feed it in and it clicks. Same thing for this one, these have touch screen buttons just like the autoclave. So we have unwrapped pouches, um, rubber and plastic, which we use frequently, and then the start button and stop button here. So the water uh, cover here for this one is right here. So you want to, again, make sure we have correct water level, and then you can start your statum. And that's basically the statum.